Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome to the Duranify channel. In this video, we're going to be comparing the Xeno 2 with the Mavic 2 Pro and seeing how well they do in slow motion. So we're going to be comparing the slow motion capabilities of the Xeno 2 with the Mavic 2 Pro. Let's get into it. Okay, so I wanted to give you some context and uh, kind of, you know, make sure everything set evenly here. Uh, the, the Mavic 2 Pro is running 4K, 30 frames a second with the Polar Pro ND16 polarized filter, where the Xeno 2 is running 4K, 60 frames a second with a Freewell ND16 polarized filter. You know, we're going to be doing this comparison over the James River, the historic James River in Richmond, Virginia, over the rapids filming a kayaker. So we're going to see some very dramatic, very cool slow motion. And I want you guys to let me know which video or which camera looks better to you. Okay? So we're going to be slowing the video down from 100% down to 25%. And then to really push it, I think we'll slow it down even more. All right, so very sunny day, flying from the opposite bank one kilometer away, all the way to the kayaker, and then I slowly start descending down in altitude. Very challenging, sunny day, display was hard to see, 
But I got some unbelievable footage and the slow-mo, it looks even better. So let's get into the video. You guys decide, drop us a comment below which one you think is better. And then I will talk to you at the other side of the video with the concluding thoughts.
work in. Hey, put the work in. Put the work in. Yeah. Told baby girl, hey girl, she gotta do it with a purpose. And Madonna by the memory, man, I heard that she a virgin. Sheesh. And I've been in the gym all week. You know baby bars, that's how I'ma drop the gems y'all need. I've been working on his body for the beach all winter. Yo, getting Pilates, watch me keep my figure. Snap back like Beyonce, kill the beats like Jigga. Share the vision, but not everybody see my picture. Wow. Like the circle got smaller, but the dream got bigger. All those things that you said you didn't mean, I get it. Oh, you really wanna come back to the team? I'm listening. You but life's different, and I'm richer. Me for this since birth. Yes. I know my worth. Go hard, put in the work. Cause I ain't come first. And I ain't even need your help. I, I, I put the work in. Put the work in. Put the work in. You gotta do it for yourself. Put the work in. I heard you looking for results. Put the work in. Yeah, you gon' have to put the work I'm in. Making the flows. One verse and murder half for your bros. 16 bars. Only need half of that for these. Oh, filter the real shit. Cause half the rappers you know, man, you gon' need exorcisms, I'm attacking they soul, whoa Turn the studio into the conjuring, vocal cords will hit you with hallways like a tsunami hit Play the game, you say my name, you roll the dice and watch the jungle come alive Soon as you make a move on some Jumanji shit, damn Everybody ain't built, if I blow up, it's Hiroshima, everybody get killed, man I'm detonating the Cold War, I'm making sure everybody get chills Made for this since birth, yes, I know my worth Go hard, put in the work, cause I come first And I ain't even need your help To give you my conclusion right so the 4k 60 frames a second on the Xeno 2 unbelievably nice but the 4k 30 frames a second on the Mavic 2 it pro it's hard to beat all right so I don't know I mean I think the 60 frames a second looks better in, in slow motion but the 30 frames a second looks really good on my Mavic 2 Pro. So my conclusions are I like the 60 because you can slow it down even more but the video quality on the Mavic 2 Pro is unrivaled in my opinion as far as the Mavic uh, folding drones. Now there are two other drones on the market today that, you get, that are folding drones that you can get 4k 60 frames a second and that's Altel Evo and uh, the Mavic Air 2 and those Two drones are 
two to three times the cost of the Xeno. So the Xeno 2, unbelievable value. Is it worth buying the Xeno 2? Absolutely yes. It's fun to fly, it's fast, powerful, decent enough camera to make some really good videos. So it's not how expensive the camera is, it's how you use the camera to make the difference. So I want to thank you guys for modifying with Duranify. If you find this video has any value at all, give the like by pressing that thumbs up button. If you like the contents of the channel, give us a love back by wham! Hitting that subscribe button, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in future videos. Yeah. <laughs>